What's up, everybody? Joshua Casper here with Plugin Boutique, and we're talking about Air Music technology again. I know, I know, but listen, they've put out more new and upgraded synths in the last quarter of 2017 than anyone expected, or really any company should be doing. It's just so incredible, and each one is perfect and awesome in every way. Today, though, we're gonna be talking about Hybrid 3, which is a couple of years old, but it's really stood the test of time. There are over 1,200 presets in this thing, and each and every one has a place in 2017's music and in 2018s. So in this video, we're gonna go quick over some highlights and what this synth is capable of. I'm gonna share with you some of those awesome presets from arpeggios to basses to leads to pads and more. Everything that's available in here, we're gonna hit it real quick, rapid fire, so check it out because it still deserves a place in your studio and in your DAW because it's just that good. Today, we're checking out Hybrid 3 by Air Music Technology. I'm excited to get started. Let's go ahead and get into it do it. All right, everybody, this is Joshua Casper. We're in Hybrid 3. We're checking it out. We've got too much to cover in this short video. So what I'm going to do is go ahead and just give you a quick tour of the Hybrid 3 user interface, talk a little bit about why it's so incredible, and then I'm just going to jump in and I've got three tracks from three genres ready to go where everything, all the synths, basses, arpeggios, pads, everything was created inside of Hybrid 3 to give you real world examples of how useful this synth can be in 2018. So right off the bat, let's check out the user interface. We got three oscillators right here. So that's a lot of oscillators right off, but we actually have a second synth page which gives us another three oscillators. That gives us a grand total of six oscillators. That's almost too many oscillators for any one person. <laughs> uh, there's also mod envelopes. You got two different mod envelopes for each page. You've got two different filters for each page. You've got your modulation matrix or your modulation sources right here, which you can then send to the LFOs. That sends us to the LFOs. We've got three different LFOs and a new pump feature, which gives you sort of a side chaining possibility if that's what you're looking for. We got velocity controls or speed controls right there. We've got the main amplifier for each page and also more modulation possibilities for the main output from each page. So here it's the modulation for the filter and here it's the modulation for the main amplifier for each page. Lots and lots of possibilities right there. Then we've got a filter envelope and the amplifier envelope. So full control there's really no if ands or buts about it complete and total control of the sound and three oscillators combined is a lot of sound to have to control but hybrid gives you the controls you need to get it done each one of the oscillator pages or each one of the synth pages has its own sequencer and it's got full control everything you want right inside of it so we can actually send one sequencer to the mod wheel to the aftertouch pitch bend and breathe like we've got just so much control here we can actually send it to two of those at once and adjust the modulation for each one of those we've got velocity controls and we've got the note sequencer right here we can actually combine notes to make them longer. Really, we've just got a lot of control. I mean, there's just no other way to put it. And the fact that I have a sequencer for that A synth and a sequencer by itself for the B synth is just the name of the game right now. Full control. If you're looking for something more complex and less simple, this is the thing for you. If you're a control freak, Hybrid 3 is it. We also have common controls. Again, just so much more options here. We've got the global controls, pitch and voice, plug-in settings, everything we need. Then we have more, we've got f up to four effects inserts here. Each one comes stocked with different types of presets from reverb to delay to flanger to chorus, vibrato, filtering types, distortion, enhancer. Look how long this list is. These are all built-in effects right inside of Hybrid 3. We can have up to four of them at any one time. Awesome, awesome, awesome. And then we also have a master effects down here. So as you can see, this is for synth A or part A, and this is for part B. And then we have a master effects section right down here. 
So beyond the fact that there are over 1,200 global presets, which can be found right here, as you can see, the list is incredibly large. And we even have the old presets from V2 or version 2, which have been updated to use some of the new features found in Hybrid 3. We can actually mix and match from the presets to build our own preset of different presets. And it's mind-blowing. This is where you do it inside of the Parse Presets panel. Just come in and maybe load up this here and this here and we'll get a different type of sound But like I said, that's just a very crazy quick run through of what's possible and what you have at your fingertips inside of hybrid 3 Let's go ahead and check out these three different projects. I've created using this synth. So this is the first project Let's go ahead and trigger it and see what's going on This baseline right here hybrid 3 This arpeggiator, or arpeggio, hybrid three. Some synth style pads. So as you can see, super lush, sounds really great. Let's jump into another project. Here we go, here I've got four instances of hybrid on this track, let's go ahead and listen. Preset. Nice atmospheric style pads. Bass number one with a bass number two. So pretty much everything there was driven by hybrid. Let's go ahead and just, just solo the patches driven by hybrid. Fantastic. I got one more project to show you. Let's jump right in. Here we go. Once again, we got four different parts driven by hybrid. Nice sub right there, very nice. Synthy plucks. Nice bell style lead for the background, some accompaniment, whatever you wanna call it. But everything is done by hybrid. And I just wanted to give you three different, completely different projects that just showcase what's available inside of hybrid. Now, most of those are just from the preset menu. I did very, very little tweaking to any of them. To be honest, I did tweak a little, little something here and there, but for the most part, straight off the preset bank, and we're getting really nice sounding tracks. So anyway, that was a quick look at Hybrid 3. It's available to download the trial version right now on Plugin Boutique. There's no reason not to go check it out and try it out. The links are in the description of this video. I hope you learned something. We'll see you next time.